some type of fairly serious food poisoning or something, or like a bacterial infection mm -hmm. from a food okay. or a foodborne type illness. Um, and I, um, the one, it was actually the night that I was in the city with my host student, so to speak, and she, so like, she, I was with her and her family and then Kennedy, and we were just like, we were out in the city and we were, we were going across, um, uh, we had to go across this cable, on this cable car thing across the river in Chongqing. It was like right in the city, and I just like, I started feeling in, like, Horrible. While you were on the cable car? Yeah. And um and so then I mean that that was ended up being bad because I like threw up on this penis. So that was really bad because it was packed and it obviously didn't oh make God. me feel any better. <laughs> the fact that there was people all around and it was moving and swaying and stuff. Um so then after that I like I just did not feel any better at all. So then um they took me the um Rose was my host student's name. She she took me back to our hotel and I was, um, I was just kind of staying, I was laying down and I, I was, I was still like feeling very sick. Um, and so then the next morning, um, Mr. Rand and Miss Cox, it was probably like five in the morning, they made the decision that I should at least go to a hospital because I couldn't like keep any fluids in. <laughs> like I couldn't, like I was like extremely thirsty because I was really, I was really dehydrated. And so, um, yeah, we went to the hospital, and it was yeah, it was the nicest hospital apparently in that part of Chongqing, but it was still not really up to the standards that we would expect because of the cleanliness was just like there it just wasn't as clean like by any means. What did you like, see like when you went in there? What did when we went to the exam room, for example, there was um, like all these other just random people kind of like followed us in there because they were just curious. Like there, it was like. It was weird because that there was you, no because you were, yeah, you're an yeah. American girl. Or? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Like they're just not used to that, especially in that part of China. And so it was just like the privacy wasn't there at all. Like just, I mean, I didn't really care at the time, but it was just not something that we were used to at all. And I mean, um, I mean, for the most part, it 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 looked pretty much like an American hospital. But then there was just like it just wasn't as clean. Like there, like um, I mean, I don't mean to be gross, but like there was like like puke on the floor from someone else that just was just sitting there, like no one was doing anything with it. Um, there was like um, bloody Q-tips from finger prick, like getting your finger pricked. I had to have like blood drawn or like blood test for um, to see the big that I was wrong with me. Um, and so like those were like laying on the floor. And so it was just, it was just odd. But um, I was there for a couple hours and the doctor ended up giving me um, like an antibiotic, some type of medicine for my stomach, and then some other like mix things you mix with water and then drink for for rehydration and stuff. So it was um, and then I, for the next couple of days I was just in bed the whole time. But um, yeah, that wasn't very fun. But I'm glad that it was like me as opposed to anyone else. Like I mean, I'm glad that it wasn't like no one else had to go through it because it was.